so properties of logarithm we will not consider any base over here because we are keeping it free you can keep any base as per your choice as per the question so right now in the properties no need to write base so the first one is log a plus log b will be equal to log of a b okay for example if i have log 2 plus log 3 so this can also be written as log 6 how it will be used when we'll do the question you'll understand okay so application of these properties you can just wait for some time after a few questions it will become more clear second property log of a minus log of b is equal to log of a over b okay same application just for an example if i have log 4 minus log 8 then it can be written as log of let's two. keep it as 2 only okay let's okay. keep it as 2 for now so it will be log of 4 over 2 and that will be log of 2 yeah okay this is same as indices only yeah this is same as indices so the next property of log is if i have log of a to the power b then it will be b log a yeah. log of a to the base a is 1 a is just a symbolic thing okay it can be any number to the same base okay so, so if i go with the example for property number 3 then it will be let's say if i have log of 8 okay so 8 can be written as log of 2 cube and this can be yeah. written as 3 log 2 so this is how we are going to use it in the questions okay okay and then this one is you can consider anything let's say if i have log of 5 to the base 5 then it will be 1 okay. okay next one log of 1 to any base is 0 okay yeah. that's the same as the exponential exactly a to the power 0 is 1 okay when yeah. you take the anti-log you'll get a to the power 0 okay yeah so these are the basic properties of log based on this we are heading towards the questions now and we will learn the application plus whatever here and there things will be there everything we'll do with the help of questions